Fell in love with a Scorpio, it's a crazy story though She was super pretty, the baddest in my portfolio She was super sweet, I would eat her up like an Oreo I don't know how I got her, I'm giving God all the glory though And she was born in October or November I really cannot remember, I hope it doesn't offend her She told me that she loved me cause I was so sweet and tender And I would always defend her and I was not a pretender <laughs> But one day she was acting so mysterious I was curious and honestly I was furious Wasn't talking to me, she really had me delirious I was overthinking, I didn't know she was serious I thought maybe she had found somebody else but honestly she told me she was working on herself she took some time off to focus on her mental health and i had to accept it regardless of how i felt huh. but all in all what i learned in the end is i love scorpios i swear scorpios are 10 but be careful because as soon as you get in she might turn around and probably ghost you in the end <laughs> what's up scorpio so we gonna have an ashley chat okay this could be new i mean i could just be starting this but you know in the beginning of this reading we gonna talk a little bit about my goddamn self okay i do this a lot look at my goddamn self this is a really good form of technique just seeing yourself doing whatever you're doing okay um this this reading is gonna feel, be for my single scorpios all right um i understand you know it, it, it could be crazy out there in the um dating world to date but scorpios when you are single okay this is a great time in your life okay for me i've always been in a relationship healing okay that might be the thing okay I always been somebody's girlfriend. The whole time I was in college, somebody's girlfriend. Got out of that motherfucker, somebody's girlfriend. When I was in high school, somebody's fucking girlfriend. Oh my God, just Ashley and somebody, okay? Now that I am an adult and I have to be responsible for a child, I just was like, I'm not going to be responsible for nobody else. You know what I'm saying? Um, And I think that... As I, you know, grew, like, I, I just could not have imagined being married at this point. I could not imagine being in a relationship with somebody. Like, I just couldn't because I just want to do some things by myself. God damn, you know? And I don't think that you guys should feel bad when you're single because I feel like this is the time for you to groom yourself. Now, I know you may meet people, you know, and stuff like that, and you may want love. I'm not saying that you won't get lonely. I'm just saying use that fuel to build something to thrive you know what i'm saying like i have so much energy to do different things do i get lonely yes i do but it's super sporadic y'all okay sporadic is just another word to say like sometimes okay it's like here and few okay and it does occur but don't use this time talking to people who are not worth any energy. Don't use this time pouring into somebody for nine years that's not going to talk to you. Like, don't use it for that. Use it to build. Use it to create, okay? Um, try to do some shit you ain't ever did before, okay? But we're going to see. You know, we're going to see. I know single Scorpios want to know what the fuck's coming, you know? So let's see what's coming, all right? All right, so for my Scorpios good okay ain't nobody finna try to give you no baby okay so i mean i don't know how y'all feel okay but children are here okay so some of you guys are too serious scorpios y'all just need to be fun a little light up like you so bitter nasty cold what's wrong with you smile okay this could be somebody that's coming towards you as well okay but you know you need to you need to do some childlike activities maybe your activities is boring as fuck maybe you just do boring shit you need to go do some fun shit okay Single Scorpios, deja vu past life, okay? Scorpio, somebody miss your energy. I don't know who the fuck this is. You could be very innocent, childlike. This is reading it upside down. This is somebody's energy projected on you, okay? This person miss you, okay? With deja vu, they feel like when they met you, they knew you. Like, dang, okay? Uh, Scorpio, all right? I don't know why. I'm trying to do who coming towards you. This could be somebody coming towards you. It's outside energy. This person could be uh feeling very childlike to you you could be very boring right now in your life and this person could give you some sense of life okay stop playing whoever this is they want to go psh, they want to go on the plane with you okay get it okay so somebody does want to come towards you they want to travel with you they want to have some fun with you somebody wants to see you in a little bathing suit okay i don't believe in two bathing suit like i just feel like that is like soft porn i know that sounds crazy like actually what are you saying i know but I always have a one bathing suit on, okay? Somebody wants to get married, Scorpio, so you do have a commitment coming in. You have some kind of union. Maybe you and this person will be traveling a lot. Y'all will not be having kids together, okay? Uh, this person could want to have kids with you, but I feel like y'all relationship is going to be childlike, very innocent, okay? And it's going to feel like y'all know each other, but y'all don't really know each other, okay? But it's a good sync, okay? That's great. Ooh, shit. Okay, Scorpio. 
when y'all first meet each other, y'all gonna both be thinking about how this is gonna be, okay? A passionate night, deep chemistry. What's up with it, okay? So somebody, well, both of y'all, okay? Because it's mutual and it's thought. So, you know, whoever this person for my single Scorpios, is gonna be a lot of passion, okay? This person gonna like holding you, sniffing you, feeling you. This person could cry to you though, okay? You could be one of them Scorpio healing women or one of them Scorpio healing men. This girl just gonna cry up like a little bitch. Like, I, I just wanted somebody to cry to, okay? So, and it's gonna be a safe place, Scorpio, because it's hard for Scorpios to break down. You know, Scorpios ain't breaking down crying on nobody, especially... Psh. You cannot cry when you Jamaican. Okay, y'all gonna be friends, okay? So y'all will be friends. Y'all will be networking. Y'all will be building together, Scorpio. Okay, y'all will be working together. You may be coming together with a team of people and y'all all gonna be breaking bread together, okay? There could be some passion here in this team where I don't really think you should mix work and, and that, okay? But it looked like it could be this down the line, okay? So whoever this person is, Scorpio, uh, for my singles, you're not gonna have kids with them, but they could have kids outside of you, okay? Y'all are gonna feel like y'all already know each other. It's gonna be passion on both sides, okay? This person gonna wanna travel with you or you guys could be traveling for work. Y'all will be working together as well as having some kind of sexual passion and chemistry. But you know what? I feel like if it does start this way, it's going to start in a work environment. The reason why I'm saying that is because passion is in this person's mind. It's in both y'all mind. It's sideways, okay? <clears throat> Yeah, this could be an old lover. Look at this shit. I said it could be, look, okay? So we got new love, new person, unknown person, okay? So this is somebody that's fairly new into your life, Scorpio, that you'll be working with. You'll be working with them on a team here. And you know, you're going to like this person, all right? For some of you guys, you don't really know this person. This is going to be somebody totally new, not somebody from your past. A lot of y'all like the CPR motherfucker from your past. You got to stop doing that, okay? I got burnt, you know, a long time ago and never healed, okay? I did put the aloe vera that y'all told me, but it's still ugly. You know, okay. Anyway, okay. So, ooh, Scorpio, your twin flame is out here. They watching you. They don't like what they see. Mm -mm. All the shit you got going on is pissing this motherfucker off. This motherfucker wished the kids that they had with somebody else was with you. This person wished they had the passion with you. This person wished they just was with you. Somebody is just wishing, okay? Talking to the moon. Okay, so somebody is over here. Yeah, this is a dark skinned male. <laughs> somebody is out here talking to the moon, nigga. Okay, trying to get this could be like moonlight driving. This could be anything with this moon here and a dog. Okay, so yeah, this is a darker person. All right, this person could have recently had on a black shirt with a button up collar. Okay, you this person got hair. We got a mature man out here. Somebody thinks about you from time to time, like, mm, okay. You got a lot of niggas out here thinking about your ass, okay? All right, somebody's thinking about getting you a gift. They want to surprise you with something. They want you to open it, be like, oh, my God, okay? So somebody wants to give you some kind of surprise. This could be you, like, how the fuck I'm going to pay for these goddamn gifts, okay? Scorpios that single, you like, God damn, all these goddamn gifts is coming in. All right, so you could be figuring, trying to figure out how you're going to do this. Some of y'all are traveling for Christmas, okay? Somebody, some mature man is thinking about how he wanted an open relationship with you and how it was a quick fling, okay? Uh, this person is mature in age, okay? Somebody could be thinking about you. You you could be the older person. Somebody think about how the passion you had, it was short term. It was an open relationship, okay? Somebody could have wanted to take you on a trip in some kind of way, all right? There's an older man that's thinking about you. This man could be Caucasian. He could have gray hair, okay? But he like, okay, well, maybe we can still hang out, okay? Somebody just want to make accommodations because they want to surprise you. They like you. Damn, Scorpio. This is a lot of niggas on, okay, look. You got a lot of people out here that's like, look, what's up, okay? Scorpio, these could be a lot of females or a lot of males, okay? And a lot of these people you don't have no kids with. That's why I feel like it's just outside energy. But these people want open relationship, short-term relationship, whatever you are offering. People are like, okay, just get what What do you want? Just If you just let me know what you want, I'll do that. I mean, this is a lot of let me cater to you because, baby, this is your day. Okay, this is a lot of that, okay? I don't know who's catering to what and what day is who, but God damn, Scorpio, y'all gotta be careful, okay? I always tell you guys, keep your private parts to yourself, keep all hands and all that stuff inside the vehicle, because when that comes out, Scorpio, it's an addiction here, okay? And it's a hard addiction because, you know, spiritual 
sex is very different from somebody who drinks a lot of alcohol, somebody drinks a lot of, you know, versus somebody who drink water, versus somebody who drink coconut juice, versus somebody who drinks watermelon or eat watermelon or eat soup, fruits with seeds in it, versus somebody who eat Wendy's and junk food every day. It's just different, okay? And sometimes, like I always try to tell you guys, when you eat these things, you vibrate differently. And what's happening here, Scorpio, is that you've changed your vibra vibrational frequency so strong that you have became a magnet for things that you don't want is poly people in here is straight people in here is bi people in here all these people still want to talk to you even if they're going left right left and center they still trying to holler okay so scorpio be careful um you know wrap it up stay safe you know um it's a lot of attention coming your way Scorpios is really private, but we'll sting if you get close. Huh? And they rule by planet Mars, they stay determined, then don't go. go. Don't make a Scorpio strike because they venom pack a punch. So you better come correct, cause like a shark, you can't get much. Scorpios get what they want, and what they want is what they get. That's they appreciate the ones they love, they ain't worth the fake shit. Uh -uh. They don't really like people switching up, uh -uh. and they can't be kinda controlling like, bitch. Shut the fuck up Shut Scorpios up. are leaders and they always think ahead And they also open minded so you gotta give them credit give them. If you date in the Scorpio and they like you, they will make you happy They also like a meal so in the kitchen, no, you can't be like Scorpios are often trendy and they got the best drip And they do not disappoint, man, you just gotta tap in Tagging shit this video to a Scorpio you